Hey everyone, I want to give you a quick overview of Video Enhance and show you some of the cool features that this app has. On the first screen you'll see we have both 1x1 and 16x9 project sizes. 1x1 is really good for Instagram, 16x9 uh, is going to be good for most other projects. I'm going to go ahead and select the 16x9 project size. So I'm going to select some footage I took earlier today. Let's go ahead and select this footage of a New York City street. We can preview it here. Alright, that looks good. I'm going to go ahead and hit the check mark and put that in the main editor. So the first thing we're going to do here is adjust the color of this clip. I'm going to hit the color button right here. And you can see we have both presets and tune. Presets will give you some preset color options to choose from. But I kind of like geeking out, going into tune, and controlling the colors individually myself. So let's go ahead and play with saturation. I'm going to take the saturation down some. And you can see this is all happening in real time. Let's choose exposure. I'm going to bump up the exposure a little bit right there. And I also want to take contrast. Bump that up. Give it a little bit more of a punchy look. Lastly, I'm going to go ahead and select white balance. Play with that. See how that affects the picture. That looks good to me. So a really fun way to dramatically change the look of your picture is to add an overlay. My uh, favorite category is probably light leaks, so I'm going to go ahead and select that. I'm going to just go ahead and start selecting different light leaks and see how that affects the video. So you can see light leaks give you this really glowy, dreamy effect that enhances the video. Let's try enhancing the look with a gradient. I like the way that looks. We can also change the blend mode to see how that feels. It's a little bit intense, so I'm going to dial that down. So I'm pretty happy with the way this video is looking right now. So the next thing I'm going to do is go ahead and add another clip. To add a clip, I'm going to hit the Add Clip button right here. So now that we have the clip in there, I want to sync up the looks between these two clips. So what I'm going to do is select the first clip, tap this button, Copy Overlays, select the second clip, hit Paste Overlays, then go back to the first clip and make sure I have the color tab selected. Hit copy color. Go back to the second clip and hit paste color. So now you can see the look between the two clips is synced. In the lower right corner I'm going to toggle this switch. This switch lets me go between repeating one clip at a time and playing back all clips. I'm going to make sure the first clip is selected. Then I'm going to hit the play button. And that's going to play back the entire video in sequence. Alright, great. Well, that's looking good. So the last step is to hit the Done button. That's going to go ahead and export it. And we can go ahead and save it, share it, whatever we like. 